Hello folks and welcome back to Weekend in Review on this very cold Wednesday. Actually it's Tuesday and we uh, we haven't had school for a couple days and you're probably sitting hopefully somewhere very warm right now. It's been a couple weeks we've been missing you. Hopefully you've been missing us as well. Welcome back. Uh, Pass, you want to explain who our guest is here? Our, our esteemed guest is uh, <laughs> Balthazar. Uh, legend is he was one of the three wise men. Actually we don't know whether or not there were three but uh, there are three gifts. That's right. Gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Therefore, we have Balthazar, who has been with us in the... Uh, uh, no sniffing, smells please. smells like myrrh. The, okay. uh, he's been with us in the Welcome Center throughout That's the Christmas right. season. And actually has something to do here. I'll move Balthazar. All Balthazar. right. <laughs> has something to do with our sermon this weekend, That's if I correct. remember correctly. Tell us about the sermon, Pastor. Uh, you know, it just struck me. We've we've always talked about the traditional story of the wise men, and they follow the star, and it just hit me. They were the wrong guys. They were the mm. the unchosen. Yeah. The wrong guys led by the wrong thing. I mean, normally we say that we cannot, by our third article of the Apostles' Creed, not by our own reason or strength, believe in Jesus Christ, come to Him. The Holy Ghost, Holy Spirit calls us by the gospel. Mm. And here are people who, called by the gospel, they were actually studying a star in the sky and they followed that which has always astounded me how could they how could they find Christ through a star uh, that's a mystery uh, we just know this that um, the gospel is the way that the spirit works in our hearts and forms faith but God our God is a God who's always reaching out to us so he'll use any number of things in order to uh, bring us to faith in fact Romans 2 4 says that even his kindness, mm can lead us to repentance and, and coming to faith. Absolutely. Well, we just found out, by the way, we don't have school again tomorrow, so stay warm and cuddly inside. We do, however, this Saturday, have our annual First Communion class. Uh, that's going to be 9 to 12 in the Olic Center for uh, families with 5th through 8th graders. And uh, Chad, sometimes we get a question about that. Well, yeah. Isn't confirmation the, the ticket into First Communion? And I think if you study the scriptures and study church history, mm -hmm. it actually is our baptism that, um, uh, you might say, uh, gives yeah. us the privilege, entitles us to receive Holy Communion. So we look at what does it mean to be a baptized child of God, and what is this gift that we are to receive? And a great gift, and a means of that grace, which should be used even by our 5th through 8th graders. Correct. Um, also, refuel coming up. We have a bunch of great classes, which you'll see in the email a little more detail. That starts Tuesday, January 21st, once we get all the snow out of the way, hopefully. And our annual Daddy-Daughter Dance cool. is coming up. It's a great event, obviously, for dads and daughters. But we do have surrogate dads. Uh, the, the SLT pastors have agreed to be surrogate uh, fathers for those of, of our ladies here who, who need that. So please don't hesitate to let us know if, if you need us. We would love to do that. It's going to be a very special night. That's uh, Friday, January 24th. And, uh, Pastor, leave the people here on this cold week something they can really hold on to to uh, get them through. God is working in your life, working through people's lives in many, many ways to get them within earshot mm. of that gospel. Mm. Just be discerning, sensitive, even the most craven unbeliever. Uh, God's still at work in his life. We're all on a mm. quest and uh, what's God doing? How's God working in the world? And then how can we come up alongside it and show them the Christ in mm. the manger of Bethlehem? Amen. Look for those opportunities. Have a great week. God bless you. Take care. It just doesn't seem like it could possibly be still doing it.